we're really excited that this event happened during the time when we are getting ready to start our Open Arms Challenge that's sponsored by Maddie's Fund. And basically what that challenge is, is to make sure that everyone has an opportunity to adopt an animal if they choose to, and also to get the community involved in the shelter as a whole, so that these animals get a lot of attention and they get a lot of publicity so that way they can hopefully get out of the shelter faster. I started this project because I like to help rescue the animals in our community. My husband said no more at my house. So um, I decided to try and come up with a different way to help. Um, so my kids struggle with poetry and this was a way for them to buy into the poet unit that I do. So they become the poets and they adopt a dog and write the poem for the new family. Um, and those go up as advertisements at the adoption fair for the regional center. They have all wrote I Am poems um, for the dogs that we have in the shelter available for adoption. And I Am poem is just an emotional poem to tell you about what the animals are feeling inside. So they did a wonderful job and so we're bringing the dogs out here so they can have some fun with the dogs and see what their, what their writing skills are actually going towards. They love it. I, the parents probably hate it because the kids are like, can we adopt this one please? Um, and today will probably make it worse, but they love meeting the dogs and they love researching the dogs and, and coming up with poems for their forever families. To bring the dogs out here, like I can't tell you what that meant to solidify the, the learning experience for my kids. Like they learned about deadlines and helping their community and it, they've been excellent. Hi, I'm Mike Warner. I'm Interim Director at RCACP. Well, RCACP is the local government shelter which serves uh, the counties of Roanoke County, Botetourt, the city of Roanoke, and also the town of Vinton. And we are the animal shelter that all the animal control officers bring stray and unwanted animals to. And we take care of them and hopefully uh, if they all pass our evaluation then we try to get them adopted. Well, I'm really proud of the uh, medical team that we have here. We're, we have a full um, veterinary staff now that we started several years ago and the uh, medical that each animal that comes in gets a complete physical with shots um, and just uh, the things that we do for them to keep their medical up and it just creates just a great environment for the dogs and cats. Uh, we use high uh, protein uh, food from Perina and most every animal that's left out of here has uh, gained a lot of weight and uh, just make a great adoption for the local citizens that come by and take our animals. Well, I'd like to see the, the intake uh, get reduced by people in the, in the community that uh, follow the strict spayed and neuter uh, protocols, get their animals spayed and neutered so that we can reduce the amount of animals that come in and just be responsible for the animal and realize that there's no judgment zone here. If you do lose your animal, just come pick it up. We just have so many animals that are lost in the valley and people just fail to come and get them. And um, we don't judge. We know that the fence gets left open and, and dogs get away and we just ask that people come pick them up. Very low fee in picking them up and most of the time we can, we can waive that or find another alternative so that they're not paying out of pocket expenses so they can get their animal. So Pantera is a cane corso mix. Um, not sure what else she's mixed with. She came in as a stray, believe it or not. Mm -hmm. She's about a year old. She's a puppy. <laughs> she needs basic training, that's for sure. She gets along with other dogs really well. Um, probably would be okay with cats, I think. She just have to learn how to introduce herself. She's very loose and, and wiggly, as you can tell. Loves playing with toys. very gentle. Um, she is semi-housebroken, so she definitely needs a little work on that. She doesn't meet a stranger. 